Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to share with you my Tram Mood Box Volume 2. So, as you may have known, Tram Mood finally started a beauty box. But it's a little bit different from other subscription boxes. It's not actually a subscription. Like you cannot subscribe to it and then secure every box. You just have to purchase every box every time they release it. So this one is the second one. I didn't get my hands on the first one. It was sold out before I, I knew it. So they actually had early access. Then uh, I tried to get into the early access but I put in my email for like four times I never got into it. I don't know what was going on, but I mean, you know, they're a small group, so it's possible that they just don't have enough people to work on every detail, but that's okay. Um, this I'm very happy that I finally got the second box. On top of that, their every box actually has different prices. So the first one was $39, this volume two, is $54 for five full-size products. I believe the first one also had four, five full-size products in there. I know it's a little bit pricey for five full-size products, um, $54. We could get a boxy box um, for eight to nine products. But you know, they are very established on Instagram. That's why a lot of brands wanna collaborate with them. That's why in this box, they actually had four new launches four out of five products are new launches. Um, one of them is the, the eyeshadow palette from Domino Cosmetics. It's their, let me show you, their Latte 2 palette. So this palette, honestly, this palette hasn't been launched yet. I believe this palette is gonna be launched in uh, on, on the 24th of this month. However, if you got a Tremble with Volume 2, you would already have your hands on it. <laughs> so it's a, it's a little bit crazy. But before I get into too many details, let's look at the box. So if you know Trend Mood, they, they have their classic purple color. I would call it the Trend Mood purple. Then if you open it, it's really interesting. They don't really have a little paper. Uh-oh. They don't really have a little paper to tell you what the products are in there. Instead, they have this QR code over here that you can scan. However, I haven't figured out how to use this yet. I didn't even try to do it, but I will totally figure that out later. Then in, in the box, it's still trim with the purple. It's pretty well packed with this um, purple packing paper in there. Then there's bubble wrap. Then you get into your products. I have already taken some of the products out because I used it to create my eye looks. Um, so in this box, like what I said, there are five full size products in there. Or maybe I didn't. I don't remember. Yes, I did. Yeah, I totally did. But yeah, anyways, now let's get into the box. So the first product I'm pulling out is this from uh, this product from uh, the company Ren. Or it's called a brand clean skincare. I'm not very sure. I'm sorry, I, I am so bad with this. I feel so bad, but you know, I'm getting better with it. I'm getting better, trust me. So uh, it's their clean jelly oil cleanser. It's designed to remove makeup, SPF, and pollution. It's, oh wait, that's not even English. But yeah, okay, I'm done. <laughs> I am done. So um, yeah, that's their cleanser. I was gonna try it, however, as I get into more YouTube, but then people keep talking about expiration dates, then it got, it got me really, really nervous. Then that's why I didn't open this. I was like, should I open it? Because I'm not gonna use it immediately. I probably won't use the thing until like half a year later or something. That's why I didn't wanna open this because based on what I say, if I open now and I use it a half years later, then when I use it, it would be already expired. Then, you know, that's not good. Then the second thing is Frasali. <laughs> Frasali liquid powder. This thing, I think this thing was just launched last week. So it's a new launch as well. Some people say this 
this cleanser is a new launch as well but i don't know um, honestly i've never heard of this brand i know i'm very ignorant about this but yeah i'm not very sure i just heard this it was a new launch then this frasali i totally know yes this one is totally new launch it was just launched last week um but i didn't open it either because of the same reason the same reason it says liquid powder and it also says in the description it said so it's an oil balancing serum with a french pink clay i can show you the packaging the box is a little bit pink then when you open it the bottle is slightly pink as well i'm wondering if the product is pink too um but anyways i didn't open it because um it's for oily balancing it's supposed to be applied to oily areas however like what i like what i said i have very very dry skin so on my face i, I don't have any oily area that's why i think i probably won't be able to use it until like summer which is half a year away you know i live in north america so okay it's confusing i mean i live in the north part of the united states so it's it's very cold outside already and the winter is like half a year half a year long um so i don't think i'm gonna use it until half a year later and based on what i said if you open it then it's only good for half a year then when i use it it's gonna be expired already right that's why I didn't want to open this. I mean, it's a frasali. I really don't want to waste this. So yeah, I just decided not to use it for now. Then this one, I feel very bad. Um, let's see, it's Skin Facts Barrier Liquid Boost 360 Degree Eye. Okay, basically it's eye treatment. It's eye cream. I forgot to use it before, before I'm doing my makeup today. I was gonna do. I was gonna try it. Um, however, okay, let's put it here. Wow, it's like. However, look, it's a pump. That's why I'm gonna pump a little and see the consistency. The consistency with you guys. Oh, oh, okay. So it's like this. I'm not gonna waste it too much. It's a yeah, 15 ml bottle. It's a very typical eye cream size. So let's blend it out. Well, it, feel, it feels very hydrating. I know Skin Facts makes good products. And a lot of times they have even have a little bit of like a medical effect. Yeah, it feels very light. It's very, very nice. It's a pretty lightweight, even though it was a thick cream. Then the next two products are very exciting. These are one, I have already showed you. It's the Dominic. Dominic cosmetics latte 2 palette which is going to be launched next week on the 24th yes that's next week the second product are these sigma brushes as you can see that i have already used these are the first sigma brushes that i own so it's very exciting for me I, you know sigma brushes are super expensive i saw a set of brushes i think those were like 200 299 dollars it was crazy expensive so <laughs> i don't know when i'm gonna be able to have my hands on those brushes but at least now i have these three sigma brushes and they feel very nice they are very soft and they apply shadows really really great so i'm very happy with these brushes and today i'm gonna have a bonus for you guys I am actually going to show you how I did this eye look. If you are interested in that, please stay tuned. So this is me without eyeshadows on. So I have done everything except the eyeshadows. Now let's get started. So this is the palette. I'm first going to use this large fluffy brush to go into this color, this light cream shade, and, and pat it on my entire lid. where I go because uh, as long as it's on my eyelid because this color is very very close to my skin color then it's basically not going to show up the reason I do this just to like set a base to my eyeshadows oh by the way I have primer on my eyes already so 
I intentionally to bring my eyeshadow a little bit inward because I feel like my eyes are a little bit too much apart from each other that then if I do this, that could make my eyes look a little bit more closer a little bit more close and I'm gonna use this smaller brush to go into this pink color so when I saw this palette, I was super super excited about these two colors the green color and the pink color I was like, oh my god, I have to get this palette just for these two colors it was crazy, so I have to use these colors to create my first eye look with this palette
but it's uh, it's pretty good. Um, I really like this palette. I mean, the color selection is really good. You know, you could do neutral looks and also fun looks like this. The shadows are very pigmented, except for that green color. Like what I said, it's um, not as pigmented as other colors. But, you know, green colors are generally very difficult to make, so I don't think I'm gonna blame them for it not being as pigmented as other shadows, but I was still able to work with it. You know, I could layer that on to get the colors more intense. So I'm happy with this palette. So this is everything I want to show you about this Tremu box. Overall, I'm very happy about this box. Um, I mean, it's a little bit pricey. $54 is a lot for a subscription box. But I'm pretty happy with everything I received in this box. So I think it's worth it. Then, this concludes this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please consider subscribing to my channel. I'm gonna have more makeup tutorials to bring to you guys. And I believe I'm gonna get better and better with my makeup skills. And I can't wait to share this journey with you guys. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.